in this video we will cover how to import x-rays into the Dentamax imaging software. First we will cover how to import a single x-ray. To do so we must first locate our patient. We can do this by typing in a first or last name up here at the top or using a bridge from a practice management software. Once we've located our patient we just click on their name and then click the view images button in the top left hand column. Next, we will hit the View Images for All Teeth button, followed by the Import Images button at the bottom of the left-hand column. Once we have done this, now we need to locate the x-rays that we want to import. If we have saved them to the desktop, we can go there or to My Documents or whatever location we have previously chosen. Once we have located our x-ray, we simply click on the x-ray and hit the Open button. We will get a pop-up asking us if we're sure we want to add this file to the patient we had opened. We just say yes. And now we have our x-ray imported into the Dentamax imaging software. The second way to import x-rays would be to import them into a layout or series. For example, if we have four bite wings that we want to get into a four bite wing layout, we can do so by selecting our patient clicking on the Take X-ray button, followed by clicking on the Take an Automated X-ray Series button in the top left-hand corner. We then click the layout in which we want to import the X-rays. Once that layout is open, we then select the first tile where we want to import. We then click on the Take Retake From button at the bottom of our screen. We select the From File option and then go to the location where we have the x-rays saved. We click on our first x-ray and click on the open button. Next we select the next tile in the sequence and repeat the process clicking on take retake from, selecting our from file option and choosing the next x-ray. And we repeat this process until we have imported all the x-rays into the layout. If we happen to import the x-ray into the incorrect tile, we can simply click on it, hold down our mouse click, and drag it into the correct tile. Once we are done importing all of our x-rays into the layout, we click our Finish button in the bottom right-hand corner. This will go through and save the x-ray to the system and make it viewable on the other computers in the office. One important thing to take note of after importing x-rays into the Dentamax imaging software is that the taken date will be the day on which you imported the x-rays into the software. If we need to change the taken date, we can do so by double clicking on an x-ray, going to the advanced options in the left hand column, and selecting change taken date. We can then use the calendar or just simply type in the day on which the x-rays were taken, and then hitting OK. If we hit our Done button, we'll now see that data is reflected underneath the x-ray. And we just repeat that process for each x-ray in the layout. Once we have made that adjustment for each of the x-rays, we then can click our Go Back button, and it will prompt us to save our changes. In this case, we want to say yes because we want it to save that new taken date. And now we have successfully imported our layout with the correct taken date. Thank you for watching this Dynamax Digital Imaging Tip. For more tips or information on our products, please visit Dynamax.com.